actually made this chia pudding yesterday. It is one of my absolute favorite breakfasts. I, I don't know why I don't do it more often. Should do it more often. Instead of just like plain plant milk, I make my own cashew milk, which has cashews, it has dates to sweeten, cardamom, cinnamon, and uh, water. So I just mix that up into a creamy cashew milk and you can also have that cashew milk in the coffee as you saw me this morning and you just add it over to oats and chia seeds and I made two jars so we have um, more for this week so now in the morning it's usually a little bit thick so I just add a little bit of plant milk stir it around until I get this like super creamy consistency Yum. I would like to start and thank Seed for sponsoring this video and also take the moment to talk a little bit about gut health. So I've been reading about probiotics and gut health a lot on Seed's website actually. I will leave a link down below so you can check it out too. You will be amazed by how much science there is behind this. Okay, so we all humans are home to 38 trillion bacteria. That's a lot. <laughs> and our microbiome is made up of these bacteria, but also other microbes and most of them are located in our gut and that's probably why you've heard gut health or gut microbiome. So you saw me take this this morning, it is seed daily symbiotic. Symbiotic means there is a probiotic plus a prebiotic in one capsule. And probiotic is not only beneficial for gut health, seed has been scientifically studied for its benefits for gut immune function, skin health, but also heart health. Often when you take a live probiotic it gets ruined through digestion by digestive enzymes, stomach acids, but the way seed has designed their capsule, the outer prebiotic capsule protects the inner probiotic capsule. So the live probiotics actually reach all the way down to your colon alive. And also all of their packaging is sustainable. This glass jar is saved and then monthly refills will arrive in a compostable pouch. I really like seed and I really like their scientific approach. Um, I take this every day on an empty stomach before breakfast. If you want to learn more about seed and gut health, you can check out their website. I've linked it down below. And I also have a discount code for you if you want to try them out. Anderson15 gives you 15% off. So yeah, that was all about my little gut health talk. So yeah, I'm gonna do something fresh. This one is so good. Um, I'm gonna show you how I make it. save the leftover marinade because that is gonna make this whole bowl to uh, yeah the next level <laughs> while the tofu is in the oven i am preparing quinoa and i've also been chopping up some fresh tomatoes waiting on my tofu and having a major day i have started to planning my meals for the next week usually i plan my meals ahead uh usually on sundays but yeah to look stay ahead of my game <laughs> and not get panicked.
but they were closed. This is the second time we are trying to visit them, but yeah. Anyway, so now I don't know where we're gonna eat, but one thing is for sure. I'm gonna take you to one of my absolute favorite places in Malaga. It is a sweet place and um, I'm pretty sure you're gonna like it too. And for ourselves. So this is the vegan and they actually have a pretty good amount of vegan options. which I save in my pot because dishes. Chickpea blondies. I know, I promise you, you can taste them. Just try to find chickpeas without any salt added. Chickpeas makes a great base for cookies, cakes, especially dense cakes like blondies. And also, of course, a nice protein boost and a fiber boost. I had to take two forms because I hadn't um, big enough. Now we're just gonna sprinkle over some vegan chocolate chips or use cacao nibs for a healthier version.
like so much. It is wrong. You can switch out the tempo for tofu. Uh, you can switch out the veggies, like the mushroom, to something else. Uh, but I really like mushroom to this. If you have the app, or yeah, you can get the recipe here as well. Um, I think you should try it.